you and I work together. You played the synthesizer, yeah. and the, I played the piano, and you had to kind of improvise, make up the part on the spot. And, uh, I did. And you, you created. Can I succeed? Created the part very beautifully, and you played it too. That's what. Yeah. It, that's what really is unique about this. Uh -huh. It's you playing with me. It's not. Well, when we recorded, was it exactly the same? We recorded this live in, 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 out in Brooklyn. Yeah. You, you just. But was it the same thing we did at the winery? It, it was, yeah. I think it was pretty much the same. It was the same, yeah. yeah. I, had tr I remember I had trouble remembering where the second chorus came in. Yes. <laughs> I, think I you remember said that. There was a couple of funny bars in there. There were a couple of funny bars, and I said, you can't mean this. And he said, oh no, I do mean it. <laughs> you had a 17 bar phrase. I said, no, Pierce, you must have been 16 or 18. He but said, it no, reminds no, no, it was 17. And then we performed in Carnegie Hall also. Yeah. Yogi with Broken Heart. We did that uh, with the uh, Tibet House concert, right? The Bed House concert. And um, Rolling Stones said that it was an opera tinge performance. Hints. With hints of Johnny Mitchell and David Bowie. Why just hints? I don't know if you were Johnny Mitchell or I was David Bowie. I'm not sure which one, but yeah. <laughs> just hints. Yeah, why, why just hints? But you told me there was a story behind the song. Yes, well, the story behind the song is really about. Um, I was actually in a swimming pool one day out in Brooklyn. Yeah, that was a real thing happening. Yeah, right? and there was a, a guy standing on his head at the bottom of the pool. I remember you told me that. And uh, I, I was beginning to practice yoga, so I, uh, I mentioned to the fr my friend, boy, he's in fantastic shape, and I know that guy, and I, he wasn't in such great shape when I'd seen him before, and now he had an aura about him, and he was just like strong as a bull. So I said, well, what's... And I got talking to him and he'd been doing yoga for about two years and he was in really good nick and he was really strong. About a year later I met that, my friend in Washington Square, the same guy I'd been swimming with, and I said, how is that guy? And he said, oh, he's completely back on cocaine and oh, he, no. he's completely, yeah, absolutely. He, he had his heart broken by some woman and he just stopped doing yoga completely and he's oh. absolutely gone the other direction again. It says something about life, how you know, you get it together and something bangs you from behind and you have to sort of get it together all over again. It's the rebirth. Yeah, this is Yogi with Broken Heart from my new album featuring Philip Glass and Pierce Turner.
Washington Square, not too far from here. That's where I heard the news. I said, How's that boy? I saw standing on his head on the edge of the swimming pool. He's a yogi with a broken heart. He's a yogi with a broken heart.